Hey everybody, Jeff Sports with John. Don't forget to subscribe on YouTube and make sure you like the Facebook posts as well and make sure you like the videos on YouTube. So continuing our NFL draft prospects by position, uh, today we're going to be finishing it off with the safeties. I'm not going to be doing kickers and punters or fullbacks just because very few of them go. So I just don't see a very really big point in doing a lot of those. So going to finish off with the safeties and that'll finish this series up. So starting with Xavier McKinney, he looks like he'll be the number one uh, safety just about by any measure, by just about by any site. There's There may be a couple sites that might have Delpit, but we'll talk about him next. But McKinney out of Alabama and you know, Alabama always has good defensive players for the most part. Um, he's got good height, six foot, 201 pounds. So uh, I think he's a guy that can, you know, pretty much uh, play either safety really. But, um, you know, he might be a little bit better strong safety just because he has a couple sacks in here, passes defended, um, forced fumbles. So, you know, he might be a little bit better that, but he could, he could do either way really. Um, so that's probably why he's the number one overall. I, I think in terms of where they'll go, safeties aren't usually a, a really high, uh, you know, draft pick. So, you know, you might see, I, I think we'd have to get beyond probably 15th before we see any safeties go. So, you know, we're looking at probably, let me look here, <clears throat> uh, probably looking again, you know, the Buccaneers, uh, if they go somewhere defense, they could go there. Broncos, another team, but we talked about linebackers there. Um, Cowboys would be one. I mean, they need a corner, really, but if for some reason they didn't have a certain corner there they liked, they could go with a guy like this. Um, they need a lot of help there. I think uh, Eagles, realistically, is my, where we might see a safety go. Um, and then from there, we're looking at, like, the Saints and the Vikings. So any of these next two or three guys they talk about, so Gary Delpit, um, or excuse me, Grant Delpit out of LSU. Now he's got really good height and size, six foot two, 213. Um, he's gonna be a load to bring down. Uh, I think he'll be in that end of the sec or end of the first round, possibly some of those teams I was talking about, maybe, maybe even as low as like um, the uh, Seahawks or possibly even the 49ers. This, this will probably be the last guy that would go in the first round. After that, I've got um, I've got Winfield um, as my number three. Now, he's a guy that some sites have pretty lower, but he's and he's out of Minnesota, but so Big Ten competition, I like that. He's a little undersized, but he's got good weight. Um, he's a ball hawk, so I think to me that makes it a little more valuable in this day and age if you can be controlled ball hawk. If you're all over the place and missing tackles and missing uh, routes and things like that, then yes, that's a problem. But if he can learn to um, control that and become a better uh, ball hawker than I think you know he's got something there and then um, Chen is my next guy Jeremy Chen out of Southern Illinois so smaller college I'm not always a big fan of that but you know uh, he's got good interceptions he's broken up passes uh, the thing I like about him is six foot three two nineteen I mean if this guy can make it in NFL it's gonna be a hard target to throw against so that's gonna scare a lot of quarterbacks uh, so if he can, if he can, um, you know, up his play a little bit, uh, then um, finish out with um, Davis, um, and Davis is another guy out of uh, California, six foot one, one ninety five, good, good height, good size. Um, you know, probably didn't play the best competition, um, but he's and he's a little slower, but he's, um, you know, he's a good coverage guy. Um, so, you know, I think, I think, you know, we're talking maybe third round into second round with, with a guy like this. Um, but anyway, that's my top five safeties. Um, hope you guys enjoyed the video and uh, stay tuned. We'll probably be launching a different type of video here with a different sport or something. And uh, you guys take care. Bye.